Hey, how's it going guys? Um, my friend wanted me to show him how to record with in Cyberlink Power Director, um, I think it's 9. Yeah, Cyberlink Power Director 9 and to record with a like a um, EasyCap. I have an EasyCap uh, D60 Plus. So, yeah, I'm just going to show you how to record and how to set it up and everything. Just gonna wait for it to open. Even though I have I record in Cyberlink Power Director 9, I um, edit all my stuff in Sony Vegas Pro 11. <sighs> it does this. It detects the device. I have a I got a built-in webcam, so it'll do that first, and then I click on that, which is this one here. And that has my easy cap, and I'm record making a Halo Reach montage right now. Now with the profile, you can have AVI if you want to. Just leave that. You can't do anything with that. Make it 30 full video size. Make it that. Make that stay the same. But make attributes 441 100 hertz, 16 bit stereo, and then like that, that's for good AVI, but if a if you have not much disk space, I recommend MPEG-2. And with mine, I have a 1280 by 720 which is uh, 720p, CB CVPBR, 8000 and 12000. I have highest, which is the best quality, and then the audio, highest and then that's that and then I just do Adobe Digital pretty much that does the best for ever for MPEG it's good and with these the settings make sure that that's on video composite which is S video is completely different only if you have S video and then you have to have line USB, which is the audio device in the EasyCap. So you, you adjust the brightness. So you, so you probably need about there. The hue you say the same saturation. You can change it like that. You can make it. That's like full color. That's like black and white. Probably want about there. Contrast. You want to put that up. And sharpness. You want to. You pretty much want to keep that there. TV setup for mine. I do have a PAL TV, or like PAL games, but I don't know why, NTSC 443 has it in colour. Anything else like PAL 60 has it in black or white, I don't, I don't know why, but pretty much you got to have your, my folder, I have a folder on my desktop, the capture card and click on that, Halo Reach. Oops, montage. Click on that. And then pretty much that'll save like that. If you do not have. To know if you have. If it actually. Like the, the right driver, you have this little symbol down here. This one here. The, the BDA TV monitor. Which means that, yeah, it's actually that. If you don't have it, then let me know and I can send you a link or. I if I can't find the link again, then I'll just send you it via email. So, yeah, pretty much that concludes the tutorial on how to record with the EasyCap. Um, I'm, I'm probably going to... I gave um, one to my friend because I had two and he wanted one. And soon I'm going to be getting HDPVR. So, yeah, just comment, like, and subscribe. If you want me to make your montage just of you or you want to be in my montage, just let me know. And... Yeah, thanks guys, and yeah, I hope you enjoyed my tutorial on how to record.